really pleased to have them back, ticking my year six. So we've had a long conversation, just reassuring them that things are different, but we'll try and do some extra things for them. I think quite a constructive time at home studying, but she certainly misses her friends and she misses the teachers and the whole schedule of school. And I think um, it's great that she's back. Yeah, it was really good to um, see my friends and just like do lots of different stuff with them. It, today was OK. I was a bit nervous, but it was not that bad. No, it was good. Yeah. We were very comfortable to send them back to school because we think uh, the situation seems to be um, under control and the school made us very confident that they were keeping everything in place to keep them safe. As a council, we have done whatever it takes to unblock things to make it possible for schools to open safely. We've done things like offer free use of council buildings for more classroom space. We are rolling out school streets to reduce traffic for schools in Wandsworth. We are making it free to rent our parks and green spaces if schools need extra playground space. And over the weekend, we delivered PPE to schools across Wandsworth. We're making sure there's enough sanitising gel. We've helped schools with their risk assessments. We are doing what it takes to make sure schools are safe in Wandsworth. Today, Sabrina was so happy and so excited to go back to school. It was a big relief for me as well, because I feel that at school, she's a, she's a, it is the most positive action to take with her at the moment. Two weeks into um, not going to school, he was telling me I was a rubbish teacher and could he please, please go to school. Um, so I'm sure that when he comes out, he'll tell me he's had a great day. He was looking forward to seeing his friends. Um, and a little bit apprehensive, but in the main he was very happy. We've been open throughout um, and with a rotor of staff, um, but we are looking forward to this next phase where more children are joining us. We should be able to accommodate all of the year groups which the government have prioritised. That's taken quite a lot of reorganisation of our site in order to do so. So I'm very proud that we've had one of the best performances in the country with 53 of our primary schools opening this week for children. And now it's time for families to take a look around, talk to your head teachers, and I hope you'll feel comfortable bringing your children back to school next week.